Welcome to Read Live. Here's a quick overview to get you started. Both students and staff members enter Read Live from the Read Live homepage. To log in, students and staff members need their account number, user ID, and password. Your browser remembers the account number after the first login, so you won't need to enter that every time. When students log in, they're taken to a landing page where they choose which program to work in for the current session. Or if they've been assigned to work in just one program, they're taken directly to that program. When you log in, the staff member module opens. You can navigate to different areas from the home page. Here you can set up and administer the program. You can also move around using the navigation menu. The commands available on both the home page and the navigation menu will depend on your role in the program. You can find your assigned role on the Orientation and Resources page or on your My Profile page accessible from the page header. To return to the home page from another page, click the Home icon. Much of your setup will be done on the Student Setup page. Teachers get to this page directly from the navigation menu. Account administrators and school coordinators click Student Administration in the menu and then click Student Setup. From the Student Setup page, you can add or edit students. From this page, you can assign licenses and lead teachers to individual students so they can work in the program. Go to the Read Naturally Live, Read Naturally Live Espanol, Word Warm-Ups Live, or One Minute Reader Live page to manage each reading intervention. For example, you can individually place licensed students who are new to Read Naturally Live from here. On this or any list in the program, you can click this icon in a column heading to filter the table by that column. For example, to display just the students in a given homeroom, use the Homeroom filter. Sometimes you can select one or more students from a list and then click a button above the table to apply it to all those students. To select a set of students, check the first box and then hold down Shift on your keyboard as you click the last box. If necessary, Use the Clear Selected button to clear your selections. One way to work efficiently is to set up groups of students that you work with frequently. Then, on pages like this one that have lists of students, you can just select the group to find those students. Learn more about Read Live on the Orientation and Resources page, or click Help for more videos, lesson plans, and other resources. You can also contact us. We're happy to help.